I'm Professor TJ. And her assistant, Nelly Welly. And today we're going to make our very own xylophone. Exciting! But before we start, maybe you should know what a xylophone is. A xylophone is a musical instrument played by striking a row of wooden bars of the same length with one or more small wooden or plastic beaters. This amusing activity that we're going to do incorporates music into an educational science experiment. You will learn about the sound waves that are made as you play sweet sounding melodies on your very own glass xylophone. You will delight in exploring the effect of varying amounts of water in each glass and you will get to make up some enchanting tunes at the same time. These are the materials you will need. Six tall glasses or glass jars, water, a pencil, metal spoon, or a wooden spoon. And remember kids, always have an adult supervising you as you do your experiments. Safety first! Certainly. So let's get started. Nelly Welly, would you like to help me? Yes! Here you go. So Thank pour, you, Professor T. Uh, anytime. So pour the water at different levels into each glass. So the first one will be full, slightly full, I guess. Pour the water, pour the water, and stop. Then add some water here. Don't make it full. Stop. Then add to the next one. And more. And that's enough. Now add here. And there we go. And then add here. Just a gently little smidge of water. That should be sufficient, don't you think? I think so. So we've left space in between the glasses so now we can be hitting it with our pencil just a little bit. But please be gentle. Don't hit the, the glasses too hard and then break them. So now, Nelly Nelly, yes, take the pencil and gently hit each of the glasses and listen keenly to the sound that each makes. Go on, hit the first glass, the next glass. Don't they sound different? Now, run the pens across, like this. Yeah. Do it again. Do it the other way. What? The other way. 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 <laughs> when the glasses are tapped, they generate sound waves that travel through the water. When there is water in the glasses, the sound waves are altered as they need to travel through the water. The more water present in the glass, the lower the sound note. The less the water, the higher the sound note. I hope you at home were able to make your own xylophone. This is all we have for you today. See you next time on Funky Science. Bye!